And have you seen this Matthew? Matthew Lawrence, all cuffed up with girlfriend Chili from TLC. Well, this morning, he sort of broke a little baby news exclusively with our Deidre okay. Behar. Do you feel like that's in the cards for you in the near future? I hope. That's the game plan. Yeah. You know, that's what we're trying to do. Go, go, My life is, is in complete bloom right now. I get to spend time with a, an amazing woman like Chili. Yeah. I've never gotten to be able to experience that kind of a relationship before. She's really, really special. Didn't you guys like wind up on the same plane or something? Oh yes, you're right, okay. Oh, so that sounds like fate. Yeah. There was this big snowstorm. I had to be back for work, so I was getting them to change my flights all around. So wow. really it was the flight talking and then afterwards saying, hey, you know what, let's keep in contact. And it almost did not happen. I mean, literally an hour before the flight took off, they were like, okay, we got you on this flight, you gotta go. Life kind of got shaken up a little bit last year. It tested me, you know, and um, and I learned so much about myself. And I'm, I'm so thankful and blessed for the opportunity to grow. And that's really what came out of it. I wound up getting involved with people that I was trying to please. Never freaking works. works. Matthew, Joey, and Andy put it all out there on Brotherly Love. Their podcast is named after the Lawrence's 90s show where E.T. saw their tight bond. They're the best. <laughs> That was why I was so excited about this podcast, is because it was an excuse for me to sit around a table yeah. and talk to my brothers and get to hang out with them. And the fam's expanding. Joey married third wife Samantha last May and welcomed his third daughter, Dylan, in January. I was quite young when I had my first you know, daughter, you know, now 46. The nights of like passing out and waking up and going, I literally don't remember the last 10 hours. What a great night's sleep. I literally haven't had that <laughs> since 2006.